hello everyone welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to show you a very easy way to puree your pumpkin step by step first you want to give your pumpkin a good wash a very very good wash remove every sand or dust or any dirt on it then you clean it dry and take it to your chopping board so first thing i did was to take off the head of it then i cut my pumpkin in half and yeah you can see the inside with some seeds so you want to take away the seeds so how i did this with i used a spoon and my hands together so it took my time to take every bit of the seed and um the the flesh in the middle so now that my pumpkin is all clean the seeds are all gone and by the way you could you could roast the seed i use it for a snack later then I sprinkle some salt on it just to add um, enhance the taste of the flavor of the pumpkin. So yeah, I'm cleaning my workspace because now the pumpkin is ready to go into the oven. I line my baking pan with a with a baking paper and just put my pumpkin upside down on it, then straight into the oven. So this pumpkin bakes for about 40 to 60 minutes that's 40 to 1 hour until when you poke a fork in it and it's really soft so you can see the fork can go through easily and you can even see the skin is coming off from it so then you know your pumpkin is ready so the next thing is to scoop out the flesh into my food processor so you could do this whichever way is easy for you so i allow this pumpkin to cool by the way i allow it to cool for some time because you don't want to scoop it while it's still hot and even while i'm scooping here it was still a bit warm so but yeah it's cool enough i could work with it You scoop the flesh off the pumpkin or you take away the peel, whichever way works for you. So I noticed that this pumpkin has um, lots of water and I'm going to be straining the water out because I want my puree to really be thick, not watery. Okay, so then I clear up this mess. Um, yeah, you can see that much water is already out of it and there's still more water to go. So right my food processor. I blend the pumpkin until it is smooth and you can see that here my pumpkin is smooth and ready the next thing I did was to strain it with my strainer So you want to get out you want to get out the water from the pumpkin as much as possible so and that is the next step so there's so much water so i just have to remove as much water as possible and when i think i've removed enough water my pumpkin puree is ready then i just pour it into a jar so you can store this pumpkin <clears throat> in an airtight container and store it in your fridge until you are ready to use it. So stay tuned to my channel and watch out for all the recipes I'll be using this pumpkin for. If you've enjoyed this video, please give this video a thumbs up, drop a comment below and let me know your favorite pumpkin recipe. So if you've not seen my pumpkin cake recipe, I'll leave the link below in the description. Just check the video for my pumpkin cake recipe and more pumpkin recipes are coming up. 
so if you haven't subscribed to the channel please subscribe to the channel also like this video share this video and i'll see you in my next video